Hey Team Trocar, Brent Chapman here. We're down in uh, South Texas. It's a nice warm March day, but it hadn't been so warm. Last couple days we had a, a pretty major cold front come through and, and really drop the temperatures down. And uh, these fish were in this little bay here and they were, they were pulling up wanting to spawn. You know, things were really setting up good for them. That cold front hit and uh, we got down here yesterday and and you know here, here we're on the tail end of that cold front and it's already warming back up but you know for for us the temperature was warm but that water temperature dropped back off and uh, you know had those fish a little bit slow to to warm up so here i got in here all excited to to catch them real fast and just cover a lot of water it really didn't play out that way we, we came through this little creek there's a a creek channel kind of wandering through to this timber here and got up there and, and pitched the uh little uh tight lines UV hog around and we caught a few but it just it really wasn't what I was expecting I've got this little you know four inch UV hog here with a little three three aught uh, TK 130 little quarter ounce uh, uh, laser sharp tungsten sinker and the, the little bobber stop I love so much and uh, we got through here and, and caught a few but it just really wasn't what I was expecting I figured it'd be a lot better th better than what it was and uh, you know, my, my gut told me there was a lot more fish in here than, than what we saw, so uh, we, we came back through and, and uh, tied on a drop shot, and I caught one or two on that, but uh, th this was the, the real deal here. We, we, we tied on the, uh, just a, a wacky, wacky wormer. This is a, our UV Anko, a 5-inch UV Anko rigged uh, wacky style. It's uh, the new uh, uh, 97 uh, wacky, wacky worm hook, and then this is the weedless wacky worm hook. And uh, we've got it with a, a little uh, rubber collar here. And we went through and just started pitching these at the, at the trees and just letting it fall down. And it, uh, it's just real, real settled. And those fish seem to be suspended in those trees. And we went back through the same area and caught probably twice as many fish. So that was definitely a big key. So, you know, this time of year, especially if you're, if you're out and things aren't really playing out the way you think, uh, a wacky worm is really a... Uh, a great technique to, to try to get a few of those uh, those tougher fish to, to, to bite with. Uh, you know, it's really an exciting time for me. I'm, I'm heading down here in a couple days to uh, start our new Elite Series season. As you can see, I've, I'm, I'm toting the Trocar colors this year. I've got a, you know, my new Triton is wrapped as the Trocar Triton. You know, it's really an exciting time for to me to, for me to be uh, representing Trocar out there on the Elite Series season, you know, being the 2012 Angler of the Year. So uh, really looking forward to uh, the upcoming season and uh, hopefully uh, bringing home another angle of the year title so you guys all uh, take care